Today I'm making a video on how you can have a very strong profile picture for your online ESL company. Now your profile picture is the first thing that parents see when scrolling through a sea of teachers, so it's really important that it has certain elements that help it to stand out and get parents to want to click into your profile and book some of your classes. So let's get started with these quick tips. It's important to have a bright or neutral background for your photo, so some good options could be a solid colored wall, an outside fence, or your classroom if it's bright and clean. It's also important to take your photo in the morning or the afternoon, so make sure you kind of time it and wait for when the sun is going to be up, and usually near a window is best. Here is my example of my profile picture. You can see I've got a bright, crisp background. I have my awesome Office Any chair. I also took this on my porch so that I had a lot of sunlight on my face. And then, as you can see, I am wearing a plain white shirt. It's important to wear something neutral that doesn't detract from your face. I always recommend for new teachers to be as gender and age neutral as they possibly can in their picture just because you want to cast a really wide net and appeal to as many students as you can when you're first starting. So having something more like a dog or a star instead of uh, say a pink doll in your photo is better to just get more students in the beginning. And later on if you want to just appeal more to one age then that's awesome but I would say in the beginning to avoid doing so. This might seem obvious, but have somebody take the photo for you or set up a timer. Don't make it obvious that you're taking a selfie where you can see your hand in the photo. You want it to be as professional looking as possible. Also, the photo should be a close-up of your face, and you should be able to see you smiling and excited. Make it look very enticing to get those parents to want to book you. So once you've taken a photo with good lighting and a nice background, you also will want to use a photo editor to brighten up some of the colors and make the photo pop even more. Our goal is to get our profile picture to stand out amongst the rest, and so bright colors really help it do that. Now something else I added to my photo to make it stand out even more is by adding a blue ring around my photo so that when I'm in my profile it looks like this and you can see that the blue ring is still around it so that way when parents are scrolling through it stands out even more. Now I did this in Canva and if you want to learn how to do this it's really simple. Check out my next video on how to add this ring to your picture in Canva. It's really simple and it's free to do. All right, well, I hope that this has been helpful for you. As always, you can either shoot me a comment below or send me an email at itsteacherdanielle at gmail.com. Everybody, well, happy teaching.